I'm just out on a stroll this morning. I've been here before in this area a number of times. You know, some with videos and sometimes I didn't make videos, but um, maybe I'll look for some fossils down the way here or uh, who knows what. I'm just gonna go head out and see what we can see today. Take you with me as always. It's been raining this morning, but getting sunny now, so it should be a nice the rest of the afternoon, hopefully. All right, I walked up this little wood chip pile, but taking my time, walk a little bit slower this morning. I saw some cool mushrooms, getting ready to take a closer look, but then I saw something else. Check it out. Make sure there's no snake in here too. There's a, you see it down there? There's a box turtle. There she, there he is. Let's see if it's a boy or girl. Oh, it's a lady. She didn't look too happy to see me though. Oh, don't worry, we're not gonna hurt you. Wanna say hi to the camera? Gonna hiss at me, huh? <laughs> Alright, she's pretty cool looking. I'm gonna take a few pictures of her and, and let her go. She's probably selling herself here nicely until I rudely... There she goes. She's getting away from me. She's a beautiful thing though. Alright, goodbye. Yeah, there's a ton of these little little mushrooms growing in here. All over, all over the place here. They did a lot of uh, they did some logging here last summer and they left a lot of wood chips. That's what these mushrooms are growing in. So all right, I was looking for snakes here too. Got kind of sunny here. If I were a snake, this is where I'd be sunning, but alright, I'm gonna keep looking around. There is a tiger beetle. See him, that bright green guy? Oops, focus. There he is. Yeah, they're called tiger beetles because they act like tigers. They walk around looking for bugs to snatch. Neat. Oops. I will let him go too. Here's a big area of wood chips on the sun. So I'm just gonna walk slowly around here, see what we can find. Any critters in here? There's some mushrooms. Let's take a look at those. Maybe. It's more of these little, little guys. Here. Check this out. This is a colony of ants. I think these are Allegheny mound builder ants. Busy, busy, busy. And now there's a swallowtail. Whoops. I think it's a spice bush swallowtail. I'll hold still. Okay. Trying to suck the moisture from the mud there. All right, we'll let it go. Oh, we got a treat down here. There's a pile of poo, and the next to it is a dung beetle. Check that little bugger out. Yeah, he's gonna, that's what he wants. It's a pile of poo. Yeah, he's in heaven right now. Well, he's gonna roll that up to into a little ball. Take it to his burrow and then lay eggs on it. See him kind of working a little bit there. Well, I'm not sure what he's doing. All right, we'll let him to his business there. It's a morning dove. That tree up there. He sees me. Oops. We'll let her go. Well, here is another pile of poo. 
being enjoyed. Let me get to the other side, my shadow's in the way. And there's a dung beetle right down there. And there's one, where'd you go little buddy? Oh, here's one over here. Kind of scooting along down there. Doesn't have any poo with him though. Yeah, they like their poo. Oh, there's a ton of eggs in this pool here. I don't know if you can see them all in there. My shadow's kind of there too. Toad or salamander eggs, probably. <clears throat> Down here's another critter. One of these red Fs that we always see. Oh, well, he don't like me. Hey, little buddy. Pose for the camera a little bit there. Right. Well, there's a little baby one down here. It's a much smaller one. Hiding out down there. His little, his big buddy was over there. You can see him. He's just chilling out down here. Yeah, here's some of our first fossils for today. Some tree bark fossils. Looks like someone else was here not too long ago, chipping away at stuff, looking for things. Well, down there is another one of those red Fs. So I'm gonna zoom in and you can see when it is that you can see it. See him? There he is, chilling on that rock down there. Asking in the sun, it looks like there. I will right, we'll let him go. Zoom back out again. Yeah, right where I was eating lunch, there's this little dude. I'm not sure what he is. Oh. Interesting little fella. Whoops. I'll look him up when I get home. You have this rock where I was eating lunch. It has, it's all, it's got fossils on it too. You got this one right here. I don't know if you can see that that's shown up. It almost looks like a snake, but it's a, it's a scale tree. I have one of these I take in to show my students. And they almost all, when I ask them what it is, they almost all say it's a snake, but it's a scale tree. Or a lepi, lepidodendron or something like that. Oh well. Yeah, so, so down where that little uh, orange salamander was, there's tons of fossils down there, but I was, I made a, I made a video of that place uh, several months ago, I think I was down there showing you what you can find, but I'm gonna walk on up further to a different site that I haven't been to for a while. We'll see what's up there. I don't wanna do a repeat of, yeah, it doesn't matter. There's, there's cool stuff down there, but I'm gonna go on a little bit further, see what we can find up there. All right, I got another distraction here from fossils, but here's a, here's one of those American giant millipedes. These things, are, these guys are just awesome. And he's about three, four inches long. They're just cool. All right, well, let him go. Well, you might recognize this spot from some of my other videos. But, yeah, never get tired of seeing this. Of course, these are piles of shale and stuff from the coal mines. There's always fossils in this stuff, but I'm headed on further down the trail. Well, in a little bit from now, I'm going to be heading down into this big trench that's in front of me. Not from this angle. I walk. It goes down pretty far. That's pretty cool down there, too. I was down there several years ago. I think I made a video. I think my first fossil video, video I made down there. It wasn't the best video I ever made, but I was still learning how to do all that with a video and stuff. But I'm going to go back down there today. 
see what we can find. There's some cool stuff down there. Most of it's along the walls of the trench, like trees and stuff, fossilized trees. So but we're going to head down there again. I'm going to take a little break first. It's been about two hours walk to get here. There's a whole bunch of fossils right down there, but anyway, I'm going to put some bug spray on too. Mosquitoes down these trenches are pretty awful. Had a wet spring, which is great for the mosquitoes. Not so much for me. All right, so take a break and then we'll, yeah, see some cool stuff down here. All right, break time is over. Let's head on. Let's head on down in and see what we can see down here. See already, you can see a lot of tree bark fossils here, all along the wall here. There's tons of like pieces of trees and whatnot. Going all up. Yeah, right here on this big rock is a really cool section of tree, like a piece of a tree here. Just awesome stuff. And even if you wanted to, you couldn't take this home. So. Let's keep going. There's a cool spider down in there. So I'm gonna zoom in on him a little bit. Yeah, he's, oh. Did he get something there? Almost, huh? Did he zoom any more? Oh, blurry. All right, we'll let him go. Yeah, so this is a pretty neat spot in here. Kind of deep down this cool trench. So there's fossils all along these walls. Probably not the safest place to be. <laughs> but, uh, oh well, it's kind of cool down here. Um, yeah, I'm not going to show you every single fossil I find in here. A lot of them are the same, like the tree bark stuff. But if I find something particularly cool, I'll show you. But, like, even here on this rock, I'm standing next to you, you can see tree fossils on there. There's a tree. So there's just tons of stuff down here. Yeah, it's just like huge sections of trees. I think there's some cool stuff coming up on the wall up here. We'll get up there in a moment. See, check this one here. See, that's a beautiful, that's a beautiful specimen of a tree right there. Yeah, this whole wall is just filled with trees, tree fossils. Oh, let's see if I can get up here. All right, let's keep on going. And of course, there are numerous pieces all on the ground here too that have fallen off from the top there. So yeah, there's a lot. There's a lot down here. No, no like animal fossils, but just a lot in this trench. And some of the other trenches, there's like you can find fern fossils and stuff. But in this one, it's actually I did find that scale tree in this one too, and a really neat piece. So, if I wouldn't dig too much along the walls, I don't want that collapsing on anybody. Alright, let's keep going. Alright, it's critter time again. Let's see if you can see it when it shows up. See it? There he is. That is a wood frog. I've never seen a wood frog outside of a pond yet or above any water, so that's cool. Whoops. All right, so you can hardly see them. Cool. Yeah, of course you can always tell it's a wood frog because it has that black part on its face, like a little mask. All right, we'll let him go. Actually, uh, descending now and down into the deepest part of this trench. So, head on down there. Actually, this little guy is still here. He won't. My foot is right next to him. He must feel pretty safe. Get a few more pictures of him, maybe. Well, it takes some careful shimmying to get down here, but even down here you still have some more cool tree fossils. Of course, we're quite a ways down now. It's kind of interesting. But, uh... 
And I gotta crawl back out of here. Just surrounded by these sheer walls. It's fun down here. But it is, it's a little dangerous too, I guess. There's, coming down here, those rocks are shifting a lot. Just rubble that's falling off the sides. So, but yeah, well. All right, gotta keep, keep going, keep searching. See what else we can find down here. Other people do come down here. I just picked up this fossil here and there was a red-backed salamander underneath. Yeah, because someone had set that fossil there nicely. And kind of just ruined his home. He was, put your home back for you there, buddy. All right. All right, well, we are out of that trench. So, I'm not sure if I might go into another one or not. I think I might just start heading back to the truck. Took me close to the three hours to get here rather than two, so I got a bit of a walk to get back. I think that's what I might do. All right, well, we'll see who knows. I always change my mind, but uh, anyway, cool stuff down there. And I did, like I said, I didn't show you every tree fossil that's down there. They're all pretty much the same, but just loads of them. It's, it's just a cool spot. It's kind of a shame that it just kind of goes to waste. It's on state game lands, you know. They don't really encourage people to visit places like this, but. Yeah, well, all right, quit rambling. Well, I'm making my way back to the truck, but let me show you over here. There's a more recent in this trench. You can see where there's a more recent class. Let me show you some of the that's that's a cool piece of tree fossil right there, not through our wall. See, there's a bunch of them over there. That was the coolest one there. So one right there too, maybe. Yes, yeah, so there's a bunch of stuff just over there too. All right, well, I lied. I said I wasn't gonna come over here, but I, I did. I, the more I looked from over there, the more I had to Come check it out a little bit. So there's just lots of neat stuff here. So here's one of those like scale trees. There's rocks falling down. You see a scale tree there. Whoops, pan out there. There's a fossil there. There's a tree fossil. Lots of neat stuff in this area. But uh, I'm gonna head out of here though. There's things falling down from here. All right cool place. There's another one of those tiger beetles. Cool little critters. And there is a beautiful morning cloak butterfly. First one I've seen this spring. I usually see them earlier this spring, but it's the first one. Cool. They're pretty. All right, well, I've hustled my way back to the truck. Didn't spend as much time hiking back because I did hiking in. Anyway, that was a f that was a fun hike. We saw. Quite a few critters out there and then some cool fossils so that was that was a good hike you never know how these are going to turn out anyway i'm going to go head home I'm tired oh i'm going to stop and pick up my uh, one of my favorite drinks at the store if they have it oh, always never like when they don't maybe i'll show you what that is if they have it but anyway i'll see you around